The 10 Tallest Women Ever Recorded Have you ever wished that you could be just a little bit taller and grab people's attention in a crowd? Or maybe it would help you land a modeling gig or a spot on a professional basketball roster. These women were more than just a little bit taller, though. Their height brought them some notoriety, attention, careers, and money. But it also came with a lot of heartache and medical issues. At number 10, Zania Bibi, 7 feet 2 inches tall. Before her untimely death, Zania Bibi was crowned as the tallest woman in Pakistan, reaching a height of 7 feet 2 inches tall. In 2003, Zania was entered into the Guinness Book of World Records as the world's tallest woman. In addition to having to deal with her enormous height, Bibi had to deal with the complications of diabetes and osteoporosis. All of her physical and medical struggles led to financial hardship. However, she was able to secure government assistance to finally help ease her burden. Her life was not an easy one. After struggling for many years, she passed away at the age of 46. Number 9. Malgorzada Didik, 7 feet 2 inches tall. She was a popular basketball player who proved to be quite an asset for the team she played with, primarily because of her extraordinary height and the advantage it gave her over other players. Didik was a WNBA professional basketball player, playing for several teams, including Utah, San Antonio, Connecticut, and Los Angeles. At 7 feet 2 inches tall, Didik is still listed as the tallest professional female basketball player in history. Sadly, she suffered a heart attack in 2011 and passed away several days later at the young age of 37, leaving behind her husband and two sons. Didik was early on in pregnancy at the time, and tragically, her young baby died along with her. Number 8. Sun Fang, 7 feet 3 inches tall. Sun Fang is currently the tallest woman in China, measuring a whopping 7 feet 3 inches tall. She's often mistaken for the late Yao Defen, another extremely tall woman from China who recently passed away. Sun was born into a poor family and started off as a normal-sized kid. After a little time passed, her parents noticed that Sun was consuming almost three times the amount of food that the rest of the kids her age were consuming. By the time she was 11, she had reached 6 feet 2 inches tall. Number 7. Ella Ewing, 7 feet 4 and a half inches. Born in 1872 in LaGrange, Missouri, Ella was the only child of Benjamin and Anna Eliza Ewing. Ella Ewing held the status of the tallest woman in the United States during her lifetime. She was a normal-sized baby and a young child, but the first signs of growth abnormality appeared shortly after her seventh birthday. By the age of 14, she towered over not only other children, but her parents and other adults, measuring an incredible 6 feet 10 inches tall. According to many reports, she grew to be 7 feet 4 and a half inches tall. However, her mother's journal indicated that Ella's growth finally stopped when she was aged 22 at 8 feet 4 inches tall. Unfortunately, this claim cannot be substantiated. Ella spent most of her time and made most of her money traveling in the circus under the stage name The Missouri Giantess. Dolores Pullard, 7 feet 5 and a half inches. Dolores Pullard was born in 1946 and unfortunately lived a short life, passing away in 1971 due to surgical complications. Dolores also had to endure bullying from her classmates as a teenager because of her unique condition. Though it was claimed by some that she was much taller, her medically recorded height was an amazing 7 feet 5 and a half inches tall. She also weighed an astounding 431 pounds and wore size 23 shoes. Billed as the tallest woman in the world at the time, she entertained audiences in the Walter Weymouth Sideshow. Number 5. Sandy Allen. 7 feet 7 inches. Sandy Allen was born in 1955 in Chicago, Illinois. She garnered quite a bit of attention by performing in the circus and as an actress. She was also featured in a documentary titled Being Different. Allen went on to write a book based upon her life titled Cast a Giant Shadow. During her lifetime, she was listed as the tallest woman in the world by Guinness. Although, over the years, other women had taken over the title, Allen held the title for the last 16 years of her life. Her extraordinary height was a result of a tumor in her pituitary gland that caused it to release growth hormones uncontrollably. At the age of 22, she underwent surgery to try to correct the condition. 
Without this procedure, Allen would have continued to grow and suffer even more medical problems associated with gigantism. Although the procedure may have helped her for some time, her condition would eventually be her downfall. Allen passed away in 2008 at the age of 53. Number 4. Yao Defen, 7 feet 8 inches For quite some time, Yao Defen claimed to be the tallest woman in the world, but the Guinness Book of World Records refuted her claims, pointing instead to Sandy Allen. Defen grew to be 7 feet 8 inches tall and officially became the tallest woman in the world in 2011, but unfortunately passed away just one year later. Born into a family of farmers in the town of Luan in the Anhui province of China, at birth she weighed 2.8 kilograms. When she was 11 years old, she had already reached a height of 6 feet 2 inches. By the age of 15, she had grown to 6 feet 9 inches tall. Number 3. Anna Haining Bates, 7 feet 11 inches. Born in 1846 in Millbrook, Nova Scotia, Anna weighed a shocking 16 pounds or 7.26 kilograms at the time of her birth. She was the third of 13 children, and all of her siblings were of average height. Shortly after her birth, she began to grow very quickly. By the time she turned four, she was already four feet six inches tall. By the time she turned six, she was five feet two inches tall, just two inches shorter than her mother. Anna hit the seven foot mark by her 15th birthday. She reached her full height of seven feet 11 inches just three years later. Her feet were measured and found to be an astounding 14.2 inches long. Anna gave birth to two children, one of which was the largest newborn ever recorded at 23 pounds, nine ounces, and approximately 30 inches tall. Number two, Jane Bunford, seven feet, 11 inches. Jane Bunford comes in at number two on the list at seven feet, 11 inches tall. She lived in England and was listed as the tallest woman in the world in the Guinness Book of World Records up until 2001. Guinness only published a copy of her birth certificate and a picture of her skeleton. In 1906, at the age of 11, Bunford fractured her skull in an accident. It's believed that the injury permanently damaged her pituitary gland, which resulted in an excess of growth hormones, which sent her height into hyperdrive. This accident would also indirectly lead to her death. And coming in at number one, Zhang Jinlian, eight feet, one and three quarter inches. Born on June 26, 1964 in Hunan, China, Zhang Jinlian survived until February 13, 1982. She was reportedly the tallest woman in modern times, surpassing Jane Bunford's earlier record. Her hands measured an incredible 10 inches in length, and her feet were measured at 14 inches long. No one in Zhang's immediate family ever grew beyond the six-foot mark. Zhang Jinlian is the tallest woman ever to be recorded in medical history, reaching an unbelievable height of eight feet, one and three-quarter inches. That wraps up the list of the tallest women ever recorded. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and remember to subscribe to our channel.